We have had this old lawnmower in service for many years and it never sees any maintenance and is oftentimes left out in the rain. And it always works, year after year. However, this year I had to do some minor repairs. Someone managed to tip the mower over and broke the plastic throttle control. I quickly grabbed some steel scraps and a golf ball and made a new lawn themed throttle control, which I think turned out really nicely. The next thing that had to be done was to replace the lower part of the handle that broke due to the very very rough use of this machine. I couldn't re-weld it because the wall thickness of these red pipes is really small. So I cut some rigid steel square tubing and doubled it with itself where it meets the mower to get the right spacing for the remaining part of the handle. I fixed it to the machine using four massive bolts. This connection will definitely not fail again. And right now I've noticed another problem. It seems that only three of the four wheels are willing to do that job. The other one can be pushed back down in position, but when under load it just refuses to stay there. After taking off the wheel on the other side the problem gets obvious. The shaft that synchronizes the height adjustments for both rear wheels had broken loose. To fix that I put the wheel back on and pushed the lazy wheel down till all four of them were touching the ground. And then I re-welded the broken connection. And yes, the mower was full of highly flammable gasoline. If life was a movie, I would have exploded in a giant fireball, just trying to repair my lawnmower. It may be not pretty, but it will certainly do the trick. And off we go again.